What's going on YouTube? So this is the 40, 40 breeder and I'm I'm prepping it for the plants that's coming out of the 20 tall in the office. Let's see. I hope to keep that somewhat, you know, the way it is with sand on let's see. Sand on this side with the rocks. And then the plants over there, and I got me a piece of uh, acrylic in there. So when I when when I put the rest of my sand in, I can pull that up, and it won't have at least in the front, it won't have the dirt right up against the glass. Yeah, I may slide it off to the side here on the side, but you know. Uh, to be totally honest with you, I doubt seriously I'm ever going to be, you know, shooting video from that angle, especially in this tank. And if I do, then it's probably going to be well after, you know, the, the plants have grown in on this tank. But I'm saying I figure I'll use a couple of... Uh, the granite rocks I got from Tennessee um, in there, so figure put those to you since they're not. I'm, I haven't used them in quite some time, and we got dirt. And no, I didn't go out and buy dirt. I got a uh, can't really tell from this angle, but. I got a ton of dirt out there from when we digging up driveways and digging out the retention pond and all kinds of stuff. So grab some of that dirt, you know, got as much of the garbage out of it as, as, as humanly possible. You know, there's no, no stems and anything like that in there that I could tell. Uh, maybe some rocks, but I think the rocks will be fine. I'm going to cap that with some more sand, you know, try to smooth it out as much as possible. And then we're going to go to planting. We'll, we'll probably put some of these in there too. You know, finally got, let me turn the, turn the light on here. I, uh, as you can see, I got a lot of stuff going on down there and what's supposed to be a double 20 long stand but sorry about that so as you can tell you know you got the algae problem somewhat under control but now it's a million damn snails in here which isn't necessarily a big problem um, you know, I don't, I don't really mind the snails all that much. So that's, that's what's going on. The, uh, Green Temple is coming in. I moved one of the, uh, one of the bigger, um, Anubius plants back here. Just to see how it would handle being in the uh, being in the dirt, and looks like it's handling it pretty well. Also, put a clump of the uh, the crypts back here as well, and then they seem like they're really starting to take off. So that's what's going on with that, and just wanted to show you guys the prep work behind the you know the twenty tall moving. Back here in, in the little fish room. And, you know, I have to apologize for all the jostling going on with the camera. I started the video before I realized I didn't have my tripod back here with me. So, doing it the old school way, holding the camera. 
But either way, it's starting to come along. And this one's coming along too. And let me say we're going to move some of those. Uh, some of those, uh, well, found out that, uh, let's see, PetSmart is getting ready to start their dollar per gallon sale. So I might not be putting any, um, any of the Mbuna in the other 40 breeder. So I may be going to get a bigger tank, uh, depending on how long their sale is going to last. But that's what I have going on. So, as always, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and we'll talk to you all later.